for today is August the 19th, 2019. It's 1.30 in the morning. I'm just done with my work and I'm heading home. I have to head home really, really fast, take a shower, get in bed because I have to wake up very early. Usually, um, I wake up between 10 and 11 o'clock in the morning. But this time I have to wake up very early because it's a very, very special day. Let me tell you why. I'm reading is Bible. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Which brings us to today. So today is her first day of school. First and foremost, things did not go as I expected or as I had anticipated them to, to go. I thought we would wake up in the morning, have some time, you know, like preparing and talking about it. But when I woke up, I remember waking up and looking at the clock and we had about 15 minutes to get to school. So it was just like a rush, 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 run, 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 get out of the house, go to school. So I did not even get enough footage of what I wanted. I wanted to get some videos of her preparing and pictures, but it's almost like we even didn't have time to the, uh, for that. But we got her there at school. We were able to take her up to her class, which was really nice. I don't think the sister realized what was happening until we got back home and she's, she saw us lock that door and she's wondering, where is Tendo? She was asking where her sister is. But it's um, an exciting day. I think for me, it's, um, I don't know. I've, I don't know there are all these mixed emotions where I feel like uh, some change, changes are coming up because right now that she's in school, Probably I'm thinking with all the things she's going to be learning and hearing and observing, this is where really parenting is going to start. Not that the other years uh, they were, were not important, they were important, but we've been fortunate enough that um, she's been home where it's either I've been home with them or mommy has been home with them. Uh, she did not go to daycare, which is a blessing in uh, of itself. But now that she's out in school, it means that she's going to be getting other influences from other places. So just monitoring that and just making sure that everything is in line, I think it's going to be something um, that is going to be different. I don't know. I just feel like it's not something uh, we've... This parenting thing is like every stage, you are just getting into something that you've never been into. Uh, so she's the first that we have in school. And so I'm just looking forward to see what is coming our way. But for me at least, um, the way I'm feeling it is like, she's gonna need more attention uh, because, again, as I said, because of the influence that is going to be coming from uh, outside, should I say outside influence. So we are going to have to give her more attention. And, of course, because now 
she is learning so um, helping the heart develop is going to be important on the other hand also her sister now they've been used to you know like they wake up in the morning they are playing together right now uh, we have to figure out how to keep uh, her sister you know like occupied as she waits for for her sister to come from school so it's gonna be an interesting journey i look forward to to seeing what is in store for for us as a family but it's really a blessing uh, children are really a blessing so we'll see where that goes um, for those of you that are parents that have already gone ahead of us give us some tips let us know what uh what were your experiences? What are your experiences? How do you handle, you know, like um, these years when they start school? Uh, what are your traditions? I would love to hear uh, what you guys, uh, how you guys handle like children, your parenting and your traditions and all that stuff. I think that's uh, something that is really important. Seeing that we have a young family, uh, Family is really important to me. All right, anyway, I just wanted to share with you uh, this special day. So I hope you guys are doing well. Until next time, stay blessed and stay safe. Bye-bye.